It was a packed house for the governor this morning as business owners, lawmakers, and hundreds of area students came to hear the state of our economy and plans for the future. The governor's address touched on a variety of topics from his recent visit to Afghanistan to education. But his main focus was on job creation. While unemployment remains around 9% higher than the national average, there are currently more than 80,000 jobs available on MITalent.org. It says there is opportunity here, and the, the challenge is, in many cases, Obviously, we have people that would like those jobs, but there's a mismatch in terms of the skills they have and the skills they need. Governor Snyder says Michigan's number one problem right now is that we're too down on ourselves. He says we need to get the passion back. It's a message some local business leaders say they'll take with them. Relentless positive action. We're all prone to not do it. This governor is committed. He's not throwing darts. He doesn't care what happened in the past. It's moving forward, and quite frankly, it's got to happen from all of us. School districts in the audience listened closely as the governor talked about funding inequities. He says it's something that will be on his agenda in 2013. It's one of the problems, because there are several problems that need to be resolved. And so let's put all those problems on the table and let's try to find a long-term solution and not just a Band-Aid. The governor did not talk about growing speculation that he could be on Republican presidential candidate Mitt Romney's radar for running mate. While his spokesperson wouldn't squash the rumor, he did say not to read too much into the idea. In Cadillac, Lauren Amstead, 7 and 4 News.